हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल मैं आशा करती हूँ आप सब स्वस्थ हैं सुरक्षित हैं और अपने घरों पर हैं इन द लास्ट वीडियो मैंने ए नोबल डॉग कहानी को समझाया था चलिए आज उस चैप्टर के क्वेश्चन आंसर्स को देख लेते हैं सबसे पहले हम चैप्टर के एंड के एक्सरसाइजेस को पहले देख लेते हैं वे विद वर्ड्स राइट द मीनिंग ऑफ द फॉलोइंग वर्ड्स फ्रॉम द स्टोरी टेक द हेल्प ऑफ अ डिक्शनरी इफ नीडेड फ्लॉप टू ड्रॉप समथिंग हैविली एक्सपेक्टेड प्रिडिक्ट और बिलीव दैट समथिंग विल हैपन वर्थ वाइल गुड एंड इम्पॉर्टेंट फस टू बी वरिड अबाउट समथिंग ग्रैंड हायर रैंक और मोर dignity stream a small river next unjumble the words to make meaningful words ugly strong young light forget antonyms complete the sentences with the opposite of the words in exercise b exercise b mein jo jumble words hame diye gaye the unko unjumble karne ke baad jo words हमने यहाँ पे लिखा है उनके एंटोनिम्स मतलब ऑपोजिट्स हमको इस ब्लैंक्स में भरने हैं प्रिया कुड सी मैनी ब्यूटिफुल टॉयज इन द शॉप द मैन कुड नॉट रीड द लेटर बिकॉज हिज आई साइट वॉज वीक द काइंड ओल्ड मैन हेल्प्ड मी फाइंड द बुक इन द लाइब्रेरी द बॉय कुड नॉट लिफ्ट द बैग एज इट वॉज वेरी हैवी I can't remember where Ravi asked us to meet him. Next, grammar and use. They have given you simple past tense. Read the sentence. The children loved to play there. The word "loved" is in the simple past tense. Underline the words in simple past tense in the passage. The children watched the magic show quietly. Watched. The magician brought a big box on the stage. Brought. He walked into it and closed the lid. Walked and closed. Nothing happened for five minutes. Happened. A girl went up and opened the box but found it empty. Found and opened. The magician had disappeared. disappeared the children were very surprised surprised write the past tense of this words bring brought walk walked cut cut ring rung pay paid find found complete the sentences using articles an owl can see at night she is a teacher in a school we saw the gateway of india in mumbai i trust him because he is a honest man the peacock is the national bird of india i have bought a new game would you like to play it with me so that is all with the exercise so first we are going to discuss answer the questions in a few lines question number 1 is who is the narrator of this story the narrator of this story is a humble retriever of unknown family agar aap logo ko meaning samajh mein na aaye to video dekhna mat bhuliyega jahan par maine ye kahani acche se explain ki hai jahan par sare words ko jaise humble रिट्रीवर ऐसे सारे वर्ड्स को मैंने पिछले वीडियो में एक्सप्लेन किया है क्वेश्चन नंबर टू हु इज रोवर रोवर इज अ प्राइज न्यू फाउंड लैंड डॉग क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री वेन द चिल्ड्रेन थ्रू स्टिक्स इन द वॉटर हाउ डिड द टू डॉग्स रिएक्ट वेन द चिल्ड्रेन थ्रू स्टिक्स इन द वॉटर द हम्बल रिट्रीवर brought the sticks back while rover 
swam round and round enjoying himself question number 4 why did the retriever fetch the sticks thrown by the children answer is the retriever fetched the sticks thrown by the children because he thought it was grand and clever to be able to fetch them out question number 5 Why did the retriever feel that Rover should be ashamed of himself? The retriever felt that Rover should be ashamed of himself because he thought he never did anything useful. Question number 6. Why did the retriever swim out of the river soon after jumping in? The retriever swam out of the river after jumping in because there were no sticks in the water. Question number 7. How did Rover behave in the same situation? Rover jumped into the river after jumping in because there were no sticks in the water. Let's go to the next section. Section B is answer the following in reference to the context. Question number 1 I am not vain but I could not help feeling how much superior I was to such a dog as Rover Question A Who said that he was vain The retriever said that he was not vain Why did he feel superior to Rover He felt superior to Rover because he could fetch the sticks thrown by the children but Rover swam around enjoying himself. Question number 6 Was the speaker really superior to Rover? Give a reason for your answer. No, the speaker was not superior to Rover because when the girl fell into the stream the retriever thought it was a new kind of game which was not interesting and swam out again question number 2 i went on a little nettled by his meekness questions are who was nettled by whose meekness the retriever was nettled by rover's meekness because rover never did anything useful What does the word meekness mean here? Meekness here means having or showing a quiet and gentle nature. What did the speaker say to the other dog? The speaker said to the other dog that he should be ashamed of himself for not doing anything useful. I never think it worthwhile to fetch sticks out of the water. and i never think it worthwhile to explain things to foolish people this is your third rtc that is reference to context the questions are who said this words rover said these words who was he referring to as foolish people he was referring to the retriever as foolish people why did he say these words He said these words when the retriever asked him why he thought of pulling the child out of the water but never fetched sticks out of the water So these were your textual questions I hope this video is going to help you a lot because I have explained each and every questions here and if you have any doubts regarding the chapter explanation then you can watch my another video where i have explained the chapter well so if you like this video give a thumbs up and also do not forget to subscribe my channel and press the bell icon for more updates because i'm going to bring you a lot more new chapters uh, from your first book and also explain grammar in details thank you everyone bye bye